wasting our calories here. Wasting calories is not possibly the best idea. But screw it, we've got quite a bit of stuff on us right now. You know what, that's probably a better idea. Yeah, look at that. Wow, that gives us a ton of hydration. Gotta love a good cup of tea. Okay. So we're gonna just rest ourselves to the point of being very, very good. Let's get another four hours out of the darkness. Woke up fully rested. Very, very good. Okay. Shamefully, there's no light though, otherwise, I'd do some reading. What's that? Dusty Pinnacle Peaches, are they open? I think they are. Yeah, there's like the tiniest little bit left of it. Hmm, not too bad. are we trying to do now right we're slacked or slaked I don't know how to actually say that uh, but right now we can't really see I don't want to waste hours of my lantern just to be able to um, kill some time but then again I don't want to head out in the dark either yeah, we'll harvest all that. It might take us a bit of time. I'm not gonna be able to carry this load for much longer. No, it took no time. Well, that was good, wasn't it? Um, so although we're fully rested, we are actually finding ourselves taking taking no time up to do what we need. We are well over encumbered, and we've got generally just far too much on us right now. Okay, um, no, don't place. Is that another pry bar? There's a pry bar behind the toilet. Get a plunger, damn it. Surely that's like a better idea, a better thing to use. Can I harvest the curtains? Oh, I can, can't I? Cloth. I mean, it's gonna thread, it's gonna. It's going to kill some time, so we'll do that. Once we get some light in here, we can actually do a bit more, can't we? So I really wouldn't mind um, trying to repair some of the gear I've got to get a better warmth bonus when we're out there. I don't have amazing stuff right now, but, you know... At least if it's fully repaired, it's as good as it's going to get. Okay, what else is there to do in here? What do you guys think? Where should I be going? What should I be doing? Because I am a bit clueless right now. I feel like I've made the best of this house and considering it was the only thing I could find for quite some distance, um, yeah, it's, it's about as good as it's gonna get for me right now, I think. Um, we're carrying far too much though. Like, really are. loads of uh, firewood and stuff which is good but I mean without actually being able to start a fire somewhere you know to be able to cook meat and purify some water then it's kind of pointless to me just make sure we've definitely checked everything we can check Oh, 
More curtains. Yeah, screw it, why not? Just for the sake of getting all the cloth, being able to do a bit more once the um, daytime comes back around. Still haven't found a hatchet. Okay, I think we've taken all the curtains that we can. No, I can reach that one. Okay, sorry for putting you guys in the dark a lot. We're just gonna keep doing this. We're just tr trying to kill that last hour. And you know what? I'm gonna get one hour of rest because that should should allow me to get that rest in now. Because I was so so well rested after being so unrested for quite a while, being exhausted. Now we are so much better off. Okay, so put that away. We can actually read these books now if we really wanted to. We're dry mouth, but we're pretty full, rested and warm. So <sighs> I think we can afford to do a bit of research. So we need five hours on that. Another one was fishing, so I think that's probably a good idea to do the fire starting one. Two hours researched. So, what else? How are we doing now? Two hours of research has made us quite thirsty. And we've got quite a bit of water actually, so that's not bad. Oh, was it, was it clean water that we harvested then? It must have been. Awesome. Can't complain with that at all. Let's eat that last bit of meat. What else have we got? 900 calories in the peanut butter. That is awesome, actually. Eat that because there's, there's nothing to it. What else? So we're, we're not too bad. We are not too bad at all. But we're carrying far too much still, so I think it's probably a good idea to just research. Let's go for another two hours. And we'll get another little bit of rest. Hopefully the, the sound of the blizzard will disappear because I really do not like the sound of it outside. Okay, right, it sounds calm. I think right now it's possibly the best chance we've had in a while to get our asses out of here. Problem being is I don't know where we're going. I do not know this area at all. But at least I can now see. I can see that there's not a lot here, that's for sure. There's somewhere we could fish on the ice, possibly over there. I mean, we came possibly from all the way over there. We, we definitely had a bit of a long walk around here. Anything else? There's another house on that little island over there. And there's a couple of the fishing kind of village type things en route. Yeah, Huts village. Huh. Not a village at all. It's just little boxes on the on the ice. But they might well be life saving. Why can't I sprint? Ah, oh, is it because I'm carrying so much? That's fair enough. Carcass over there. Ooh, and another house. Right, okay. That is potentially a couple of houses there. But I do want to check out what's in the middle of this island. So, annoying as it may be, 
We're going to get ourselves there. And I think we might actually have to stop for a while. Because, unfortunately, guys, right now it is 6.30 almost in the morning. I've been doing this all night long because because I work nights normally. I, I work in a supermarket which is not a glamorous job at all but it pays the bills and it's nothing that should be you know you sh shouldn't turn your nose up at anything that's going to pay the bills and feed your kids so yeah it nothing glamorous but it's a job at the end of the day it's better than sitting around doing nothing I, I just can't stand doing nothing that it drives me insane so for the time being then we are literally just going to be getting ourselves comfortable and safe and I was just saying that and there's a wolf actually have to use a flare en route to the house over there. Oh come on, it's only minus four. Mm, yeah, so I think I think it's possibly a safe bet. So there's some sort of carcass over there. Right yeah, we're definitely gonna need to flare just to get ourselves there safely. I don't know if I can make it up this side of the hill. So I might actually have to walk in front of the, the damn wolf. That looks like it could even be a wolf's den. Which is potentially a really bad place to be heading. Yeah, I think that's exactly what that is. Stay back. You look pretty calm. Ow! Fuck me! Fuck! 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 Oh my gosh! My word, that is like the worst that has ever happened to me. Have I dropped anything else? But I need to get to this house. I need to get there really quickly that smarts a bit that's a bit of an understatement what, what is I can't even remember what it said was wrong with you but you are you're not doing well mate so uh, blood loss let's sort that out really quick sprained ankle we can live with inspect infection risk let's do that as well just get it out of the way quickly Right, okay. Sprained ankle's not exactly going to slow us down any more than we're already going. <clears throat> Considering we've been going for hours exhausted and right now we're carrying more than we can handle. I don't know what will happen with the wolf because I think I stabbed it or something so you know, if we're really lucky we might find it somewhere frozen where we can harvest its meat and potentially the, the pelt too misanthropes han homestead okay another coastal house so very similar to where we were at earlier then I guess. Yep, some other good stuff. Potentially a fair amount of good stuff. There's another lantern. Fridge freeze to check out. We've got a hole upstairs. Most likely with a bed yet. Very good. I think we are pretty good here. At least for now. So I would say right this second I am going to need to sit my ass down and 
heal. So painkillers. That will sort that out. Okay, nothing else needed there. We're warming up. We're losing energy, water, food. We're still really over encumbered. This is all potable water still, so let's take that. That's good water. It's going to help us out a lot. All right. I don't know whether the temperature is going to drop a little once the flare goes out. I think it probably will. So for now, this is working, but for how much longer, I don't know. I mean, it would be super sweet if there was somewhere I could cook here. But, yeah, considering we've got potable water, I'm not overly concerned. But I think for the minute, I'm going to end on a really good note here. Um, we, we've had a pretty eventful night. We, we came across a couple of wolves. We managed to get rid of them. Um, one had us by the throat, but we managed to get him off us. So that is good. And um, I, think, I think we're going to just sign off now. Call it a day here and get our bearings for the next episode. Or the, the next recording session where we're going to loot this house. We're going to evaluate what we're carrying because we are carrying far too much um, and then we're going to try our best to go back across the lake or the frozen sort of sea area and we're going to get to the huts that we saw with the boats because um, at this point although I've got plenty of stuff it's worth stopping off at every point just to recover the heat recover food and water that's been used and just generally get some time out of the storm because at the moment it, it seems to be absolutely freezing. I don't know whether it's the area or or what but it seems extra cold here like all the time. So without further ado I would like to thank you guys so much for watching. If you have enjoyed the video please leave a like, leave a comment and let me know. Um, it would be really good to know exactly whether you guys have any tips for me, any sort of any advice as to how I can improve. I don't I don't want a, a, a full guide, like a full sort of written sort of essay on go here, go there. I, I really do want to explore the map myself and, and learn and get my bearings as I go because it's part of the experience. I I enjoy being immersed in it and I hope you guys enjoy the footage I'm I'm getting for you. I hope you're enjoying the the experience that we're hopefully having together on this journey and yeah once more thank you guys so much for watching if you like the video leave a like leave a comment and if you're new to my channel consider subscribing this is just the beginning of season two and um yeah check out season one see what you think uh let me know what you think at the end of it because there's a real unexpected end to season one and uh, yeah, I, I wasn't even expecting it myself. But thank you once again. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.